Heaven is right here. All the agates. My favorite stone. My favorite stone. Hi. Right, so today we're looking for hearts. So these are the juicy pieces. I'm going to be cutting up and turning into hearts. And we're looking in this area. So it's daunting sometimes to find the right beautiful pieces. But when you do, you get exquisite hearts. All of these pieces I get to select from. Ooh, look at the size of this one. I love it. This is my style. Everybody knows I like it big. I like big geos. Here's the guys are working. He's cutting them. Taking all the buzz out off. This tractor is picking up all the extra buzz out that we take off the geodes. So this geode, we have to keep going through the buzz out until we get to the actual field and look inside all stalactite. Amazing piece. Oh my gosh, look at these great, beautiful, majestic agates. They're huge and I love it big, bad and bold. Here I'm trying to create how I want to cut it up. Maybe I'm going to cut them in slices, polish it out, but I really don't want to lose those swirls. Now check this one out. This one I'm going to turn into a chair. That's right. And it's 500 pounds, so we have to figure it out. We can only cut it one time, so we can't make mistakes. We brought out all our guys. Fabio and I are designing how it would be sitting. I thought of an idea of it swirling around and we sit in four different areas, but he's like, no, let's make a captain's chair. So here he goes. He's going to come. We're going to hold it together. And then afterwards, we're going to decide how to polish it and which is the best way to make nature's art decor nature's functional art and I love doing this believe it or not it takes me about a year and a half to get this to finalize between picking up the rough designing creating getting all the guys to polish it and to make it work will take over a year and a half and then it has to be cargoed all the way so little by little we create magical pieces check out this rough agate we have that beautiful round there. That there is going to be sparkly. We have all these different kind of textures. You see the Swiss cheese texture where I'm going to be polishing. We're pulling that one out to make a beautiful piece. Then we have ones that have all different kinds of, of feels, of, of swirls, of geodes. This is a part of Joya, which is a, going to be sliced open. It looks like a jewelry pot. Oh, there goes the butterfly. And then here, we have all these different kinds of shapes that makes them so unique when we do our designing. Ah, and we'll check out that agate. Isn't that fun? It's really cute. Here, we're going to be opening it up using the druzy and then polishing all the outside. It'll be really cool. The fun thing about designing with agates, you can make moons. You can make... Oh, Things they eat you. <laughs> and you can make uh, cut base, you can do polish, you can do uh, just geode halves. We can polish the tops, create tortoise looking agates. We can do pears and we can do bookends. And we can make so much fun, especially the hearts. Here are amazing new hearts that are coming to you, a new shipment coming to you right now. I really want to thank you, sending all the love of hearts and the love of agate to you.